Okay, so it's time to measure and apply the rule. What I did was took a measurement, used inches, and about a half an inch overhang on each side, which means I have to add an inch to everything. And you could just bring your ruler so that it shows an actual half inch overhang. So that gives me five and a half by six and a half. And that gives me a really cute overhang. You want that overhang. And this is what I'm referring to in my photo. Where the roof comes beyond the walls. The roof line comes beyond the walls on all four sides. The reason for this is in reality, if, if it didn't do that and it fit like a glove, just end to end, the rain would literally pour inside the birdhouse. Now, even if you're only using this for decorative purposes, it makes more visual sense as well. Aesthetically, it looks right. And that's what I have here. So before I go ahead and cut the roof out of a slab, um, because construction could change size, I wait till the end of the construction of the base before I go ahead and measure out the roof. I like this size. I can see it before I see it in slab. And I'm going to go ahead now and cut this out of slab. just want to make sure I place it. I'm going to make some registration marks. I want to make sure that the nice side is facing out and I want to get a balanced look. Okay, so I have the roof placed where I want it and so now I'm just going to make some marks with a pin tool so that I know where to slip and score so that the two could be joined. Okay, so once again, make sure before you attach the roof that you've got everything on the inside worked out. In the situation of a birdhouse, it's unlike a container. Once we put the roof on, we're not going to see the inside anymore, so we're not going to see the issues if we do have some. So just do a once over, make sure things are blended and smooth. Now it's ready for attachment. My score lines are there, and now I could score. Attach with some slip. I want to make sure I've got enough water on there and that I line it up. I can just do a visual and do a little pressure. And there you have it. This is the basics. Now, my entrance for the birdhouse is going to be on this side, and that's the next thing I'm going to measure out.